Hey everyone, welcome back to another Fox Tech video and in this one we're gonna discuss how you can recover deleted Safari tabs on your iPhone. Accidentally closing tabs can be frustrating but fortunately there are several ways to retrieve them back. I'm gonna walk you through some of the methods step by step so let's get started. At first, let's talk about one of the simplest methods and that is the long press on the plus icon. If you open up Safari on your iPhone and navigate to the tab view by tapping on the tabs icon at the bottom right of the screen, once you're in here, press the plus icon, but when you just tap it once, you will get to a new tab. However, what I want you to do is to long press on the plus icon. This action will bring up a list of recently closed tabs. From here, you can scroll through the list and tap on any tab to reopen it. Keep in mind that you will need to recover the tabs individually using this method. Another effective way to recover your closed tabs is by searching your browser history. Safari helps uh, to keep a record of all of the websites you visited, making it easy to find specific tabs later. To access your history, tap on the book icon at the bottom of the Safari screen and tap the clock icon then to view your history. If you remember a part of the website's URL or name, you can use that to search it using the search function to find it quickly and reopen it. Now, another method, but kind of like handy one, is the shake to undo feature. This feature allows you to undo the action of closing tabs by simply shaking your iPhone. But you can only do it right after you've closed the tab. To make sure this feature is enabled in the accessibility section of your settings, under the uh, touch section, you should ensure that shake to undo is turned on. So this is how it needs to be set up. And it's important to understand that different methods can be more or less effective, of course. So this might not work all the time, but in case you just closed a tab, you can just shake your iPhone and undo it if the button or the prompt pops up try if it works but as i say it only works for the immediate closing of tabs anyways these are all of the methods which i know of if you have anything else let me know down below in the comments but for now that's about it thanks a lot for watching see you guys later <laughs>